Okay, so in this video, we're going to take a look and see what the within method within Cypress does. So we've got a simple test here at the top where we're visiting the Learn Cypress site and we're grabbing a class with a BG course hero and then we're using this dot within method. So what, what this will do is this will scope any subsequent commands that we nest within it inside of this element right here. So this will limit the scope that Cypress uses to look up these elements. So within our background course hero element, uh, we want to get the anchor tag and we want to make sure that the href attribute has um, an attribute of hashtag courses because this links to a certain section on the home page. So when we view our test, we can see that it passes. So here's our hero. This is our get, and then within, we're scoping all the subsequent commands to within this entire section, and then it's grabbing our, our button right here at the top of the page. Okay, in this next test, we want to make sure that the links within the courses drop down link to the correct page. And so the way we're doing that, we're going to the same site again, we're clicking on the courses drop down, which opens up a menu. So once we grab that menu, we use dot within again to scope our request to only look for anchor tags that are within this drop down menu. So then we side dot get the anchor and there's multiples of them so this way it'll return an array of all of those elements and so we're using its to grab the first anchor tag and we're asserting that the href goes to this link right here and then we're doing it again for the second element so we're getting that array with multiple anchor tags we're grabbing the second one and making sure that it goes to this link right here. And so when we, you look at our test, we can see that everything's passing.